you can see it, line of sight, tornado right there. Whether it's worn or not, you're witnessing it with your very own eyes live right here from Brandon Coppock in Greenfield, Illinois. And this is showing you that rotation at the surface rising all the way up. Now, thankfully, it's over a rural area and some debris uh, and some uh, farmland picking up some debris like dirt. But on the left hand side, you are seeing a tree line and a possibility of some communities downwind of this. Now, this looks like some very broad rotation. Even as we're talking, it looks like it's starting to dissipate. But notice how high that dirt and debris is rising. And there's another one right behind it, right? Multiple areas of rotation in this one line. And we're about to hang it right here. And you're seeing there is a storm chaser in front of them. I believe that's Corey or Vince. They run in tandem here. And you'll notice what's about to push right in front of them, right? So I don't think it's rotating tight enough to actually get all the way up and connect with the storm ahead. But it's still impressive. And it just passed another silo, something that Brennan's already experienced earlier this week out of Iowa. Now in Illinois, and there's the farmland silos on your right, right in front of you. You have one and two different areas of rotation. It looks like it's trying to connect to the thunderstorm, which would make that a tornado either way. This is impressive as you watch these dance through the farmland and you'll see some locals that are pulling off to the side, throwing on their hazards. There's the confirmed tornado. Yep, exactly where we thought it was. Greene County, Illinois, also into uh, Macpookin, uh, Macoupin, I should say, Macoupin County, Illinois as well. Uh, here's what also is happening with these visuals that we have for you. You're not only witnessing it live here on Fox Weather, but this is what the National Weather Service is looking at times as well. And they're able to use this video and say, OK, yeah, this is confirmed. Radar showing us rotation. We're also seeing that as well. As we show you this on radar, too, we can run a side by side. This thing is impressive as you're looking at the hook. And this is well defined as you get into that inflow. Team, let me know if we can not talk to Brent. I know he's doing a lot of work right now. He's positioned himself where he's parked now, so hopefully we can kind of get him to walk us through this analysis. So, Brandon, if you can hear me, this is Steve Bennett with Fox Weather. I'd love to get your uh, insight on what's happening there with the confirmed tornado as it pushes through Greenfield right in front of you. Yeah, Steve, I can't talk much. We've got a large multi-vortex tornado on the ground, as you guys can see in my shot. Uh, this thing was producing tornadoes before it was warned. Thankfully, they warned it. But this thing has had a tornado on the ground for at least the past 10 minutes. You guys can see it right in the middle of my shot. Agreed with you. Yeah, we saw it. There was definitely two areas of rotation dancing, even a third at one time. Brandon, thank you for quickly checking in with us.